So we're a partner on this event uh, with the Kern High School District and uh, our premier sponsor is Chevron. And we have about 19 other sponsors uh, supporting this amazing uh, half day uh, talent retention event. So we have 4,500 students uh, from throughout the county, about almost 150 employers. And so basically it's showcasing the incredible opportunities in Kern County, STEM as well as non-STEM opportunities. And then the employers are, are basically going to chat with the workforce of the future. And then the students are going to see, wow, there, there are incredible career pathways in the county. My name is Jeremy Shoemaker with Employers Training Resource. And we to support our organization is we support the young people, just find different avenues for employment opportunities, training opportunities for the future. When you're young, sometimes you get pigeonholed into certain things by circumstances. And coming to an event like this, you're allowed to see things you may not normally see in your everyday life based on where you may or may not be. So this organization and this event is important because it allows these young people to get access to different types of career paths that maybe they didn't think about that can spark an interest. I hope that they get an opportunity to see all kinds of different career fields and maybe find a place where they feel like they fit. Hello, my name is Kate Gunderson and I'm a mechanical and aerospace engineer, um, former NASA engineer turned test pilot school student. I kind of talk about how I'm a big picture person and so like in college a lot of times it's very theoretical and you don't get a, a really good idea of how you're going to um, implement the concepts you learn into the real world and so I started interning in undergrad and that really gave me the self-confidence to see like oh I can use what I'm learning in school in the real world and actually be a good engineer and um, I think that's like really the most important thing of, a, of an event like this. Chevron invests in these types of events along with many other companies because it, it shows and demonstrates and it gives students an opportunity to see the various um, options that a STEM career and a STEM major can provide. Like I said earlier, I see myself in these students. I, I've walked in their shoes. My story is no different than many of, of the students here, right? We come from very humbling beginnings and backgrounds. I see myself in every student that's walking here. I ask, was there anyone from South High? And there were two or three hands that went up and I was like, great, we have South High in the house. This is my community. And so to me, I find that a lot of joy in being able to give back to these, this community, give back to these students. I see myself, myself in them. And like I said, hopefully they take with them enough curiosity and inspiration to look beyond today and say, well, if she could do it and she is no better than me, I can do it too. What is an awe for me today? Um, just your facility is absolutely magnificent. The students I've talked to are absolutely amazing just about their excitement for the opportunities available to them, the careers that maybe they're going to go into, but certainly just their excitement to want to come to school. One of the things I see about career and technical education is that's what we do. We bring their academics together with their passion for whatever career it is and brings it so it makes sense to them. I hope when they leave the expo today, they have a better understanding of the opportunities that are available to them, that there are not only opportunities, but there's ways to learn that information so they can be successful in those opportunities, that they've touched something that's made them go, oh, I could do that. I want to, I could be a paramedic. I could be an aeronautical engineer. I could be an information technology specialist, but knowing that there's more than maybe what they experience at their school on a daily basis and that there's something here in the community that they, where they can go and learn those skills and be successful as they move forward in their lives. Oh, hello, hi, my name is Christina Calasides from Ridgeview High School. The students are so excited. They want to come back next year. They love being here. They can't wait to listen to the speaker series. They want to um, share with their friends back uh, in the classroom who didn't get to go, all the fun things they saw and all the exciting things they learned. An adult could be troubled by, but that doesn't need to be remembered. From beginning to end, it was great. You know, we've done this event for, I believe six years now and so every year we try to do something a little bit better and a little bit better and uh, it definitely showed off this year.
here. It's been very smooth, um, and so really happy with the, the entire process. I want them to leave with hope for their future. I want them to leave with excitement about multiple potential futures, all these different careers that they could pursue. And I want them to realize they could do any one of them, and, and I want them almost in some ways to be like, which one do I want to do? And they kind of look at themselves, look at their grades, maybe talk to their counselors, reinvestigate their possibilities, but recognize that not only do they have a bright future, but they could potentially have several bright futures depending on which one they wanted. So they, they just they talked to us and like they gave us a lot of information on like what's offered. Well, they, you know, there's a lot of great opportunities like from uh, students coming out here and like you know having all kinds of classes, opportunities to do all kinds of education and everything. I would like them to leave here with a vision of what they could do in their futures. That would be the one thing.